as long with two names, Kiki and Bopa, uh, and asked them to associate a name with a shape. So uh, they had uh, participants from diverse uh, linguistic, cultural, and physical backgrounds. Uh, and despite that, uh, within 95 to 97 uh, percent of, of the people, um, they called the spiky one Kiki and the round one Boba. So we basically wanted to create an experiment that would uh, allow us to explore kind of the, the ties between uh, the visio, uh, visual and, uh, and audio. So sound field, uh, basically we had our uh, some audio engineers um, create different tracks, um, each of which, which gets loaded into a 3D environment uh, and visualized uh, using the waveform uh, as these kind of orbs that are reactive to sound. Um, we built this in Unity, so we're taking advantage of the uh, baked in 3D uh, sound. So as a user actually walks through the environment, um, it's a different mix. You can hear different sounds uh, as they approach. You can hear different sounds uh, further away. So you get a, a different uh, experience as you move through. Um, one of the things that definitely jumped out at us is that this is uh, fun to move through, but the real power here is being able to uh, actually move around the objects, um, change volumes, add modifiers, uh, add additional effects. Um, so the next version of this is essentially a much more robust kind of 3D audio creation and editing tool. 